Don't even think about it. Oh, gee, I don't know, Bronson. I think it's just too good to eat. Oh, I don't think so. I think we ought to test it out right now. Just in case it's no good. No way. It's Faye's birthday party. She's having the first bit. Why do the Gribbles have to come? Oh, he invited himself as usual. He's campaigning for votes. We just have to make sure that Faye has a good time, especially you, Bronson. I can't come. What? Why not? I've got something else on at five tomorrow. Must be important. It's going to be heaps of food. Yeah. You're coming, Bronson. Faye already thinks you don't like her. I do like her. I've even got her a present. <sighs> Look. <laughs> Gee, that's expensive. Ooh, talk about tasteful. Must have cost a mint. Yeah, good, isn't it? But I still can't come to the party. It's a matter of life and death. It's not the present that counts, Bronson. It's you she wants. She won't marry me if you don't like it. But I've got something important to do on the 4th of September. Uh, leave it to us, Dad. Bronson, you're in need of a little counselling. We're going to have a sensible, quiet chat. <laughs> Dad! <laughs> say it, Bronson. I'm not stopping until you say it. Stop! I'm doing I'm telling Dad! Say it. I'm coming to the party at 5 o'clock. Say it. Say uh, it. All right, all right. I'll say it. Coming to the party next year. Oh, you think, ah! Bronson? Ah! Give me a chance. Listen, I got a big problem. Big problem, eh? Well, why don't you tell us about your big problem right from the beginning? Well, it all started when I was exploring Turtle Island. <laughs> o'clock every year. Same time, same place. Like clockwork. For 200 years she's been coming here, guys. That's why they call her Old Faithful. But who paid 500 bucks just for a tortoise? A zoo, dummy. Mm. And $4 for every egg. Yeah. 200 years is pretty old, Bruce. I'm a ah! You leave Old Faithful alone! Turtles are infected! <laughs> I think you mean protected, small shot. <laughs> Who's going to protect it anyway? Me! You and whose army? <laughs> cool. And that was six months ago. And tomorrow at five o'clock, Old Faithful arrives. Same time, same place. It's like clockwork. And right when Dad's having the party for Faye. Well, what are we going to do? Oh, I worked it all out. I've been planning this for six months. I've been saving my smell. Saving your smell? <laughs> That'll be the day. You've been sharing it around pretty generously, if you ask me. No, listen. Remember the time Miss James came to tea? Oh. 
That's when I first realised that my smell was special. Um, what's that smell? Bronson's feet. I did lots of scientific experiments under cynical conditions. When Fiona's dog nearly passed out, I knew I was onto something. So I saved up the pong for a while, and when I was down by the river where the water spirit lived, I tried it out over a long distance. And it worked. You gotta move on, Bronson. I'm leaving in ten minutes. But I still needed a human guinea pig, just to be sure. What is that smell? It was pretty strong. Ugh. Ugh. Bronson, wash those feet. I kept my shoes and socks on for months. Didn't even take them off when I went to bed. Hey, I'm in the nude. So that's where my shower cap's got to. Why are you wearing your shoes in the bath for anyway? You lot started to get a bit suspicious, but I got away with it. Oh, Bronson. Those feet are foul. How long since you've washed them? About six months. <laughs> six months? It's my secret weapon. <laughs> Pull the yellow one, Bronson. Never... <laughs> oh, no, cop this thing. I use my feet to knock out the gang to save her and the eggs. <coughs> but you've got to be Faith's party or she'll crack the sads. If you're not there, Dad'll freak out. Yeah, but what about the turtle? We can fix Gribble up at school. There's only two. He won't need one. They're his feet. You don't smell your own. Yeah, you catch turtles, Grips. You hypnotise them. They can't stand the sight of human eye. Knocks them right out. Hmm? I don't know, Grips. It seems a bit cruel to lock them up in a zoo. Oh. Mr. Snapper, can we have the key to the sports cover, please, sir? What for? Well, you know how you said about protecting endangered species. Yes. Well, um, are turtles endangered? Oh, yes. Yeah, some species have vanished forever. Well, we're trying to save one. We need to borrow something. Is this on the level? Yes, yes sir. sir. It's right back. Thanks, Thanks sir. sir. Oh, I wasn't even locked after all. Thank goodness there's no one around. Yeah, except for us. Step aside, twist. Kill a 200 year old turtle, will ya? The bomb. <laughs> Double nuts. <laughs> and that's gonna save the turtle. <laughs> Fruit cakes. <laughs> You coming to my party this afternoon? <laughs> I've even got a present for you. It's a real good one. You want to see it? No, no, keep it to this afternoon, but I'm glad you're coming. <laughs> the party wouldn't be the same without you. Yachi, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I might not be able to come. I've got to save old Faithful. And what about the baby? Come on, come on, no, but... no but. The dodo is extinct. Unfortunately, not one of them has survived to pass on its genes. You can have mine, sir. Dad says they're worn out. <laughs> Very amusing, Pete. There are many vanishing species. It seems that rabbit, gribble, and tiger are among them. Could we be excused, please, sir? I think we've lost enough students for one day. Did anyone see any of the whales yesterday at Logan's Beach? Oh, oh. Bronson. 
Can I please go to the toilet? We only just came in, Bron. <laughs> it's urgent. Well, all right, but don't be long. And don't forget to wash your hands. Go on, hurry up. which were turned into unusual and striking hats. It's a shame, really, because this unique mammal managed to survive the Ice Age only to be defeated by people. Yes. It's unfortunate, but many species have disappeared in the wake of civilization. The Mongolian cat was a little beauty. Look at where Gribble, Tiger, and Rabbit usually sit and imagine that they'll never be there again. That expresses symbolically, in a microcosm, the disappearance of species. Anyone smell anything? Pong! Oh, goodness! What is that? We're being invaded! Species, sir, a little booty. See you, sir. Don't panic, sir. I think this should mean another vote for us. But you don't think it's a little expensive for someone we hardly even know? Up the pump! That's the beauty of it. It looks expensive, but it's not. <laughs> but I promised Dad you'd be a fake party. Those kids better be here soon. Faye will be here any minute. Faye. Faye. Faye's here. Faye! 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 Oh. Harold. Gribble. I'm a nerd turning up when I'm invited. Matron. So, where's the uh, birthday girl? Uh, not here yet. The children? Not here yet either. Oh. Well, <clears throat> it's a birthday party, Harold, not a political party. <laughs> Up the ball! Come on, Johnson, we're late already. We'll miss the party unless we hurry. Oh, get a move on, Rabbit. Come on, we've got a day. We'll fix them. These feet are unstoppable. Quick, get on my back. You don't want the water to wash away your power. We have to go back. What about Old Faithful? What about the party? What about Dad and Faye? We have to save the turtle. Dad and Faye are more important. We've done our best. I'm warning you, Bronson. You've got to come home. Kirk, how come? But it's not fair. Go and wash your feet. We'll wait here. You'll be glad you did the right thing, Bronson. Boy, 
These mass are boiling. You're telling me. <sighs> Faye! Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Faye. Oh, thank you. Thanks, Faye. A little present from the Progressive Conservative uh, Party. May that little token Where serve you. Well, uh, we're all here. The kids aren't here. Oh, no. Typical. The kids, well, the owner's here. Well, they're around somewhere. How about Pete and Linda? Where are they? Oh, they'll be coming. They'll be coming. Bronson? Bronson, Bronson. Uh, Bronson will be here any minute. Any minute. Uh, Bronson will be here. Where did Bronson go? I don't know. Here I am. Oh. One day, you'll thank me for this. You'll be glad you did the right thing. You little fink. Up the pong. get across this river without washing my feet. Save old faithful. Yes, I can. And might I add that once the new casino complex is complete, it will provide the perfect venue for a party. No cold breezes. They'll be here. No worries. Won't be long now. It's no good, Tony. They don't like me. I can't marry you if they don't want me. Look, they'll be here. You'll see. They're probably getting the surprise ready. Look, they think about you all the time. They even dream about you. Yes. Ah, there they are. I told you, they wouldn't miss your party for the world. Would you, kids? Where's Bronson? <laughs> um, he can't make it. Oh, he, he must have gone to the wrong place. He needs a good talking to. He should be here. Doesn't he want a new mother? <laughs> it's no good, Tony. I think Bronson's giving us a message loud and clear. Well, maybe he thought it was a beach party. He's old. It's older than my old man. Grips, think I can see something. Right, you guys grab her, I'll do the hard bit, right? Uh, I'm not stop. sure about it. Stop! You leave off, wait for What? <laughs> I'm warning you! I'm scared. He's finally got his shoes off at last. <laughs> Probably can't top his own shoelaces. <laughs> he couldn't even top his own thong. <laughs> hey, give that back! Make me a big away! <laughs> There they go, they're in on pursuit of the young kids. Oh, the boys no. fall. Tiger takes the lead. The out of form young supplies. Oh, no. oh, but it's no future in this hill, my friends. Ladies and gentlemen, it's dead in city up there. Twist get up, mate. What's going on? Oh, yeah. The boys gone now. They're chasing. Tiger takes the lead. Anyway, Rabbit goes. Tiger takes the twist. Oh, Rabbit's coming up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, we 
better run that twist. Come on, please. Oh, I'm back in. I'm back in, aren't you, Tags? Oh, terrifying. Oh, I hear the names. Oh, that's that with yours. Suck. Suck. Oh. oh. The Bronson's got a, a special present for you. Um, he bought it himself. Oh. Haven't you, Bronson? Oh, yeah. It's in his pocket there. Oh, um, it's here somewhere. Saved up for it. Good lad. Here it is. Oh. Here we go. Here it is. Just for you. Oh, Bronson. That's... <laughs> Have you ever, ever felt like this?